I have a question. As young generation, I can see some people do crazy things to get closer with God, which is not actually in the Bible. And should I do the same thing? Is that true? Why should I have a strong foundation in Christ? Yes, uh, there is a very common quote. They'll say, building is strong, but the foundation is weak. If the building is strong, but if the foundation is not weak, the building will surely crash down. There's a very sad story I read recently of a true incident that happened in Africa. Hundreds of people along with children were found dead in a forest inside Africa. You know why? Because there was somebody misleading them, saying that, oh, you have to starve to reach heaven. You have to do this to reach heaven. And all the children, the mothers, the fathers, they started starving themselves. And finally, there were so many dead bodies found in the forest because they followed the leader and the leader taught them the wrong things. But what is the one thing that we realize from this story? If our faith is strong, if we are rooted, if we have a strong foundation in Christ, no matter what people say, no matter what we listen or what we read, nothing will be able to shake our faith. There's a beautiful verse from Colossians chapter 2 verses 6 and 7 which says, As you have received Jesus Christ as Lord, be rooted in Him, be built in Him and live in Him. Yes, that is what we have to do from our childhood, even we as parents, as mothers and fathers, from the time our kids are little children, even when they are one or two or three years old, we have to root them up in Christ so that when they become big, nothing will be able to shake their faith. Even if somebody comes and tell them, tells them, you have to do this to re receive Jesus or you have to do this to uh, go to heaven, they will never be shaken because they have a strong foundation. Even us, let us remember to have a strong foundation in Christ. Even if you're working or if you're studying, remember to always be in touch with God. Even if you don't have any time when you're going in the car or when you're in your free time, when you're having a bath, speak to Him, speak to Him and the Lord will surely speak to you. That is how we stay rooted in Christ. So today, if you're facing any difficulties and if you have found a way to cross that difficulty and continue to stay rooted in Christ, let us know in the comments below. It will surely be a blessing to someone who watches this program.